Hi, I'm Bob Holcomb from Apex Automotive for Demand Studios to show you how to remove ABS brakes. This is the brake caliper, the brake pads, and the brake rotor. This wire here is your ABS speed sensor. Underneath here is an ABS speed sensor ring. The sensor senses the ring as it spins and gives the computer an idea of how fast your wheel is spinning. In order to remove an ABS braking system, you want to use extreme caution not to disturb the ABS speed sensor or the speed ring, as it's very easy to break them when the rotor and the caliper are coming off the car. So we're going to remove the bolts that hold the caliper onto the spindle. After the brake caliper is loose, you want to use caution not to disturb the wheel speed sensor wire. The brake caliper should never be allowed to hang off of the brake hose. Typically we use a coat hanger to hold the caliper up out of the way. After the caliper is removed, we're going to remove the brake rotor. So we're going to use some vibration to remove the brake rotor. This is where you want to be careful not to disturb the wheel speed sensor which is directly behind the rotor. You have now safely removed the ABS brake components. As you can see, our speed ring is intact as well as our ABS speed sensor. We're going to take our new ABS components, brake pads, brake rotors, and possibly a caliper, and reverse the procedure that we just saw, being very careful not to disturb the speed ring or the speed sensor that's bolted into the knuckle. For Demand Studios, I'm Bob Holcomb of Apex Automotive of Great Barrington, Massachusetts.